the testimony the world needs. April 16. Transformation of character is to be the testimony to the world of the indwelling love of Christ within us. The Lord expects his people to show uh, that uh, the redeeming power of Christ, which is the grace uh, of Jesus Christ, uh, can work fully in the hearts of men and women. The Bible is quite clear in the book of 2 Corinthians uh, chapter 3 and verse 2. The Bible says, you yourselves are our letter of recommendation written on your hearts uh, to be known and read by all men. Uh, understand, as we consider the two words, you, yourselves, uh, as we look at you, yourselves, uh, we realize that Paul referred uh, to the transformation of those believers uh, as the power of Christ to transform him and then to transform others uh, through him. So understand that as Christ transforms one, uh, that transformation is not only limited to that particular individual, but Christ transforms individuals, and then Christ uses that same person who has been transformed uh, to work on the lives of others. Uh, you might be wondering today uh, how you can be like Paul uh, to declare as such. Uh, you must first of all understand that you must allow God uh, to transform you. When you allow God to transform you, uh, then automatically he is going to use you in transforming others. Uh, understand, it's easy. Uh, how could God work within us? Uh, just relate your testimony. Uh, testify of his goodness within you. Uh, testify of his love and his grace in your life. Why not trust in his word uh, today? Let us ask God for the opportunity uh, to share our testimonies. Now that's the power of the word. Uh, Lord, we thank you so much uh, for all that you have done. And we pray today, O oh Father, that you will transform us into your likeness. Uh, we thank you so much in Jesus' wonderful name. Amen. Remember, my dear friends, the power of the word every day will keep the enemy at bay. Get ready for your